Washington, D.C., U.S. Navy Los Angeles-class submarine built in the 1970s, 80s, and 90s, but remains vital to today's service fleet and remains in service more widely than any other class today. Although the Los Angeles ships would be progressively and rapidly retired in the coming years, they formed the main foundation of the Navy's undersea force and contained several impactful technologies designed to counter Soviet submarines in the Cold War. The Los Angeles class of submarines is a class of nuclear attack submarines owned by the United States Navy. One of its main missions is to provide protection for the carrier battle group, which is a collection of aircraft carriers which is the core of the United States power projection at sea. Los Angeles submarines have a critical role in protecting and sustaining United States maritime power in vast waters. Carrier battle group protection is a vital task because aircraft carriers are the primary target in modern maritime conflicts. The Los Angeles submarine is designed with advanced technology and weapons that allow it to operate underwater at high speeds, effectively hiding itself from adversaries. This allows the submarine to approach an enemy that might threaten the carrier and take the necessary countermeasures. In addition, the Los Angeles-class submarine is also equipped with a cruise missile system capable of destroying ground and surface targets. This provides an additional capability for submarines to counter threats on land that might harm the carrier battle group. With this weapon, submarines can pose a significant threat to enemy forces in various battlefields. Los Angeles-class submarines also have an important intelligence role in the protection of the carrier battle group. They can carry out enemy monitoring and reconnaissance in waters, gather information on enemy activities, and report back to commandos. This information can be used to plan and carry out effective military operations to protect carriers and associated battle groups. In addition to its primary role in the protection of the carrier battle group, the Los Angeles-class submarines can also be used for other missions. They can be used to observe, monitor and patrol the waters with a strategy. This submarine can also be used to carry out attacks on enemy ships or coastal installations with its weapons. The capacity and capabilities of the Los Angeles-class submarines also make them ideal for anti-submarine operations. They can detect and track enemy submarines, and if necessary, launch an attack against them. This makes them an important part of defending against underwater threats and maintaining United States naval superiority. In addition, Los Angeles-class submarines can also be used for overhaul and overhaul operations. They can be used to search and rescue stranded cruise ships or in emergency situations in wide open waters. The submarine is equipped with facilities that make it possible to provide medical and logistical assistance to those in need. In conclusion, the primary mission of Los Angeles-class submarines is to provide protection to the carrier battle group. They fulfill this role using advanced technology and weapons, as well as strong intelligence and intelligence capabilities. In addition, these submarines can also carry out various additional missions, including reconnaissance. Los Angeles-class submarines now make up a large part of the Navy's current submarine fleet, but they will be reaching the end of their service life when the Virginia-class ships arrive. In fact, Navy decision-makers and Congress have long expressed concern about the Navy's impending submarine deficit in which the size of the fleet for attack submarines, according to service commanders, will drop low enough to massively increase the threat to the U.S. U.S. Navy 30-year shipbuilding plan now for years it has broken down its strike submarine deficit given that the Los Angeles sub will be retired quicker than a new Virginia sub can be added. For this reason, Congress and the Navy have been engaged in a long-standing effort to flex the industrial base to increase the number of Virginia-class ships built annually from one to as many as three, depending on the budget. For example, the Navy's shipbuilding 2024 plan does call for production of two Virginia-class submarines per year from 2024 to 2028. This budget request is based on an extensive industry base capacity study, which has determined that electric boat and Huntington Ingalls industries can be flexible to accommodate the higher production op tempo. This means that despite mass production of new Columbia-class nuclear-armed ballistic missile submarines in the coming years, the Navy and its industrial partners will still be producing two Virginias per year. This is significant if there is continued support from Congress, as the first Columbia-class ships are scheduled to arrive at the end of the decade for their first patrols in the early 2030s. Los Angeles-class ships serve as underwater eyes and ears for the carrier battle group. With advanced sensor capabilities and sonar systems, the vessel can detect any underwater threats that may threaten CBG. Los Angeles-class submarines are equipped with powerful strike capabilities. 
they can launch Tomahawk cruise missiles which have long range and high precision to destroy enemy targets that are potentially threatening to CBG. Los Angeles class submarines can operate independently or in groups to provide additional protection against potential threats. They can cooperate with surface ships and aircraft to form a more formidable defense. The Los Angeles class ship's stealth capabilities allow it to approach enemies undetected. This allows them to conduct reconnaissance and intelligence gathering on enemy forces that may seek to threaten the CBG. Los Angeles class ships can also be used to secure communication and logistics lines between the carrier and its support vessels. They can patrol around the operating area to identify and eliminate threats to these pathways. In a war scenario, the Los Angeles class submarines can face enemy submarines seeking to stalk and threaten the CBG. They have strong anti-submarine capabilities, including torpedoes and anti-submarine missiles. Los Angeles class submarines can also protect aircraft carriers from long-range ballistic missile threats. They are equipped with missile defense systems to counter such attacks and keep the CBG safe. The Los Angeles class ships have high speed and good maneuverability, which allows them to respond quickly to emerging threats. This is important in providing effective protection against moving CBGs. In carrying out their primary mission, Los Angeles class ships use their expertise in underwater reconnaissance, strong strike capability, and agility in responding to changing situations to maintain the safety and success of the carrier battle group and carrying out their duties.